here, we're going to have to start guarding. Uh, we cannot just allow people just to go past us, past us, past us uh, on the perimeter. And, and that, that was uh, the case in the first half. And, uh, you know, they're good. But, I mean, mercy uh, to give up 76 in the first half was tough. What is that, in your opinion, Dave? Is it um, a, a personnel thing? Is it a lack of practice thing, uh, the, the guarding issue? Because I know you were talking about it in the timeout. Where do you see that arising from? Well, just, you know, guys got to get better at it, uh, just guarding basketball one-on-one -on -one and as they get older and, and more experienced and, and uh, bigger, stronger, uh, faster, and we'll hopefully we'll have that, that opportunity. How difficult is it for you through the course of a game to have two guys go down like that in such a close game and have to adjust to, to bringing guys in to fill those spots? Just what I have to do is what I have to do. Coach, uh, realizing you know hindsight's twenty twenty, what were you seeing there that um, in that that kind of final play down three? You know, to, you didn't call timeout, and what you wanted to see in that regard? I see a very teachable moment. For, for what we were trying to do, yeah. I mean, there, I can call timeout and get that shot. So what we're trying to do in that situation, I only have one timeout left. I'm trying to go put the ball on the floor, get to the basket. If they help off, you get an open three. They don't want to help off and they don't want to foul. We're trying to get a quick two and extend the game, try to foul. Maybe they miss and you're down two. If you don't miss, then you drop your three-point play and you get one at the end. And then just the other, just uh, Justin Jackson, him especially in that second half. I don't know if you touched on it before I walked in, but uh, the defense he had on Durant, at least making he was in his face. I know Durant shot over him a few times, but just what did you see from him? Yeah, he, you know, I thought Justin had a, had a nice ball game. So, um, you know, they battled him, and, and uh, you know, those guys are they're bigger, uh, and they're 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 great players. You know, and and uh, I thought you know he did a great job of of uh, we talked about it in the huddle. You know, just keeping your chest in front of him. If he makes a shot because he's six thirteen, then he does. You know what I mean? So, Dave, how much are games like this just kind of a part of growing up? Yeah, I'm not thinking about that right now. Um, those last couple minutes playing with the lead, did you guys get them a little more stagnant than you would have liked offensively? Yeah, we stood, we stood and watched too much, and uh, you know we're not at a at a level uh, where we can, you know, ISO and you know where you can close games and you know you get the ball to spots to dudes and and uh, that's what they do and, and make those plays and and we're we're still learning uh, what we're trying to do and and what we're trying to where we're trying to get the ball and and we do we struggle in the half court to score and so that's why we have got to keep attacking till there's 10 seconds left in the game and playing as fast as possible